And so those of you guys that are looking to go into college, I want to give you guys four practical tips to consider. Um, one of them is, consider, is your degree transferable? The reason why I'm talking about this is because a lot of times, especially in churches, we have Christian colleges, we have different colleges that are starting up, and they promise you, you know, we're a new college, so if you join us, we're gonna, you're only going to have to pay one-fourth of the tuition because we're a brand new college. We're not credited yet. By, by the time you graduate, we will be credited. So a lot of people join that college, and that college never gets credited, and your certificate, your degree is not legit. And so you have to... Uh, ask if your degree is transferable. A lot of times in Christian colleges, they are great, but your degrees do not transfer and none of your classes or credits do. So you have to consider that. Another thing, um, are there jobs in your field for the degree that you're going to? If you're going to go, you know, study the ocean and you're living in Tri-Cities, you know, that would probably not, a um, fun degree, but probably not the best thing to go for. 70% of people do not use the degrees they go for. And so something to consider, what is the job field market in this area, in your city? If you moved even, is there jobs there and what is their pay? Um, and the third thing is cost. Now, I know a lot of kids, a lot of high schoolers, we all have this dream of that college dorm life, you know, but you don't want uh, that four years to be paying off that dorm life, that college experience for the rest of your life. So you also have to consider the cost. So you can get an AA degree in a community college, or you can go to university, which is twice the cost. And so I guess we just want to encourage you guys to not stay away from student loans, but to make wise decisions now. Because as you're graduating, you're going to have all those, I think they have in college, probably till this day, those tables uh, where they encourage you to sign up for this and you'll get a donut. And when you're a college student, you're broke as a joke. That donut looks so good that it's worth that $20,000 of debt, right? And so we just want to encourage you guys to do your research. When you're signing up for something, what are you signing up for? Because right now, in America, it is $1.1 trillion of student loan debt. And the average, the government makes about $50 billion in profit from students. Because you get off of high school and you're like, this is great. I'm going to get 40 grand loan and then until you're 60 paying it off. So we just want to encourage you to be wise about your decisions. Talk to your mentors. Do your research. Is there any cheaper colleges? A lot of people say... One last thing. A lot of people say that, um, you know, I have to go to a university or else it's not going to look good on my resume. And that is a myth. So I got my bachelor's in a, a community college and I had the option of going to a community or, universi or a university. If your community college is certified, your degree is the same. When you go work for a company and their requirement is you have to have a bachelor's or a master's, their HR department is just going to look that you met the criteria. They are not going to care what college you went to as long as it is certified. They're not going to care how much you paid. So you're going to be getting a good job while your colleague gets the same job, but yet they still have 50000 to pay off. So, you know, there is also that 90% that you deal with. It is your decisions. And in this church... Those of you guys that are interested in going to a Christian college, we first advise you to take our internship program, to go through a school of leaders, and you will be more equipped and educated, hands-on experience than you will at any Christian college. I can give you guys that hands down, all right? So you guys, that 90% that you also have to make wise decisions. And they start when you're 18. They start when you're right out of high school. They start in your 20s, that you start making those good decisions so you're not spending the rest of your life paying off debt, paying mistakes, and benefiting 50 billion towards the government. Amen? Nothing wrong with our government, bless it, but not with your debt. Amen?